I don't think a lot of people understand how blessed they are to wake up and see another day. I don't think people really realize and really truly appreciate being the age they are and being alive, being healthy. Um, I was talking to my grandparents and they are both um, in their 70s. And people really don't realize to make it to 70, man, you got to be blessed. Out of all these tragedies, all these sicknesses, right? Um, and to make it to that age and still be healthy, still be able to move around, um, go and come as you please, you know, that's a blessing. So I'm making this video to let you know, listen, man, you can be 15, 21, you know, in your 30s, 40s, 50s. Let me explain something to you. <laughs> Uh, do you know how many people have, you know, lost their lives at the age of 15? You know how many people have died of tragedy at the age of 20? Didn't didn't make it to see 21. People have died in their 30s, their 40s, their 50s, you know, from sicknesses and diseases and, you know, just all type of things. So I'm making this video to let you know, man, listen, man, you're blessed. You know, rather whatever it is you're going through in life, you know, you got to wake up. And you really just got to look at life for what it is and say, you know what? No matter what I'm going through, you know, I, you can be broke right now. You can uh, be in a bad relationship with somebody going through with family members. You know, whatever it is you going through in life, you always got to revert back and have an understanding. And remember, man, I'm blessed. Because, see, your worst day could be somebody else's best day. And I say this all the time because right now as I speak there's somebody who just lost their life there's somebody who just lost a loved one right now as I speak there's somebody who just got shot who just got stabbed um who just got sentenced to go to jail for life right and never get to come back home right so so even if you waking up and you having a bad day you got to understand listen your worst day is somebody's best day somebody will trade you somebody will trade you your day for their day Somebody, somebody just got in a car wreck and lost their legs, right? Somebody's working at a factory and, 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 and their hands just got cut off. Man, this world is crazy, man, and it's going down. And I don't think a lot of people really realize the magnitude of what we live in and what's taking place every day. You got to wake up and you got to be thankful no matter what. But in the midst of your being thankful, right? If you in a negative time in your life, you got to say, you know what? When I wake up in the morning, I'm going to try my best to be positive and not only be positive, but I'm going to work towards positivity, right? I'm going to wake up and I'm going to be positive. No matter what, no matter the outlook, no matter what's going on, wake up and be blessed, man. And that's not me trying to preach to you. That's just me saying, listen, man, it's, it's going down out here, man. You know, from America and all these other countries, man, it's going down. You know, for you to even wake up and just live in a house is a blessing. You know, somebody woke up under a bridge with nothing. No house, no family, no money, no food. Somebody somebody woke up in the homeless shelter. Somebody, somebody, somebody woke up in jail from the crime they committed last night or the poor decision that they made last night. And they gotta deal with it today. So, wake up and deal with whatever you gotta deal with. But in the midst, always understand that you blessed. Because your worst day is somebody else's best day. Remember that, man. Y'all wake up. Y'all stay blessed. Peace.